There he is. Come on. There he is. Oh, yes. Hard to look at a cute yes. dog like Eddie and know that in spite of all this love, his life will be short. He has a serious heart defect, and at some point, overexertion will kill him. He's tired today. My whole family's going to suffer when he goes. Oh, I could cry. Because mm. he's our boy. It's, it's heartbreaking. But Debbie McQueen is angry, too, alleging the woman who sold Eddie knew the problem. She imports them. They come from the Ukraine. That seller is Oksana Medvedev, who was charged two years ago. Documents show her vet diagnosed the heart problem as a puppy. But when she sold Eddie to McQueen, the diagnosis had been removed from the paperwork. She knew she was caught. So I took both reports that I had, the copy she gave me, the copy that her vet gave me, and I took it over to the, the police station and they did an investigation and charged her with forgery. The charges were withdrawn and Medvedev was ordered onto a peace bond. She also paid expenses to McQueen. It's not even about the fact of what it's costing me. It's the emotional part. Every day, um, we suffer. Get it, get it, get it, get it. There are many others out there connected to the same seller. First sign of trouble was the, the runs that he had. Justin Tepperman's new puppy had a series of viruses, including Jardia, but within days it would get worse, a serious ailment called an anal prolapse. His rectum had fell out of his bum. So what should be inside yes. has now come outside. Exactly, and that's a very serious thing, and that happened three more times. Each time worse and more costly, thousands of dollars in total, largely paid by insurance. He's like months old, and this poor thing's like crying in pain. CBC News has also confirmed health woes with others who've complained, including that puppies either came from or were suspected to have been born in Eastern Europe, known for its intense use of puppy mills. Often sold for thousands within days of import on Kijiji. You stop growling. Including Petey. Would you ever buy another dog off Kijiji? Absolutely not. We ask Kijiji about it, and they tell us they are adamantly opposed to puppy mills, saying they take swift action on ads that reference uncontrolled breeding. In a statement from her lawyer, Oksana Medvedev disputes that she acted improperly, negligently, or dishonestly in the sale of puppies, saying she never knowingly sold a dog which she knew to have health issues. Regarding the charges, she claims the allegations were false and did not acknowledge any wrongdoing. Give me five. Good boy. Meanwhile, Debbie wants the import of foreign puppies for sale to stop. Innocent people are buying these dogs. They want them as pets. So she needs to be shut down. Good boy. A message and a warning to others looking for a pet. Love you. Oh, David yeah. Common, CBC News, Port Perry, Ontario. Yes.